to the Pakistani people's desire for uh, democracy. And so we are very glad to be able to uh, partner with the people of Pakistan and the Pakistani government uh, on a whole range of issues that uh, are of common interest and common concern to us. Pakistan transitions as the United States and other coalition forces uh, end their combat role next year. Uh, and uh, Afghanistan is fully responsible for its own, uh, its own security. Uh, and I pledge to uh, fully brief uh, the Prime Minister and his government as we make progress uh, in uh, not only um, Afghan elections, but also uh, a long-term strategy for uh, stability in the region. And uh, the Prime Minister and I both agree that it is in uh, America and Pakistan's interests for uh, Af uh, Afghanistan to be uh, stable and secure, uh, its sovereignty respected. Uh, the Prime Minister has had uh, very good meetings with President Karzai, and I know that uh, President Karzai very much appreciated uh, many of the gestures that uh, Prime, Prime Minister Sharif has made, and uh, I'm confident that uh, working together uh, we can achieve a goal that is good for Afghanistan but also helps to uh, protect uh, Pakistan uh, over the long term. Uh, and we had an opportunity to discuss India. Uh, and the Prime Minister uh, had the opportunity to meet with uh, uh, I very much appreciate uh, all the work that Prime Minister uh, Sharif has already done. Uh, he has great challenges ahead of him, uh, but uh, he is somebody who I think uh, understands where Pakistan needs to go. Uh, and we want to be fully supportive of continued uh, success and continued uh, uh, democracy uh, inside of Pakistan. Thank you for your support to democracy and good wishes for the people of Pakistan. Ladies and gentlemen of the press, I've just had a most cordial uh, and comprehensive exchange of views with President Obama on matters of bilateral interest and issues of regional concern. I've conveyed to the President, the warm and cordial greetings of the people of Pakistan for the friendly people of the United States of America. Over the past 65 years, our two nations have traveled together as friends and allies in defense of freedom and the pursuit of international peace and security. Besides shared history, our two countries are bound by a common commitment Will you allow the American government to have CIA here in Pakistan uh, to conduct cross-border counter-terrorism missions against Al-Qaeda, ISIS or the Taliban? Absolutely not. There's no way we're going to Seriously? allow any bases, uh, any sort of action from Pakistani territory uh, into Afghanistan. Absolutely not.